Hello August and hello to all the people who are born in August like me. Today is the 2nd of August and this is my birthday and it's the first time I share it on YouTube. And so I just want to say happy birthday to all the Leos like me and to all the kings and the queens of August. It's a fresh start no matter what we have been through before. And so forgive yourself for all what you have done before and now just give yourself kindness and self-love. This is the simplest gift you could give to yourself. And I thought why don't we buy ourselves a present as well? And so I'm gonna buy myself a book as a present for the first time And I wanted to share an earring tutorial with you in my birthday You could make this earring for yourself as a gift Or you could make it for your lay friend And so let's go ahead and watch it together Hello everybody, what do you think about these earrings? Let's go ahead and learn it together We need chains, charms, jump rings, hooks, chain nose pliers, cotton pliers And we need beads but that's optional Starting by taking the length of the chain that we need, we could use the ruler for that or if you don't like the ruler, it's okay, just put it aside. We will take the length immediately, but that depends on the amount of charms that we are gonna use. And so if you're gonna use four charms like me, we need to know how many chains we're gonna leave between each. And so I'm gonna leave two chains between each charm, which means that I need ten chains in total. It's okay, I get lost in numbers too. And so count the chains and cut it with the cutting pliers. For the second pair of the earring, put the chain immediately to take the exact same length or use the ruler for that and take the exact same length and again cut it with the cutting pliers. So now the chain is ready and it's time to put the charms in the drum rings in the chains with the pliers. Oof, charms and chains, we get lost in that, right? Now we will put the charm in the drum ring and then we will put it at the end of the chain. Just to make sure to close the jump ring well and voila, this is how it looks like. Now it's time to put the second charm and so we'll get a jump ring again, put the charm inside it and then we will count. And so here is the first charm, we will count one, two and then in the third one we will keep it. So here, put the jump ring inside the chain and close it well. And here are both the charms. Now we will continue adding the charms and now it's time to put the jump ring and the hooks. We will open the drum ring, put the hook inside it and then we will join it with the earring but instead of putting it with the drum ring of the charm now we will put it in the chain don't forget this close it well and be happy because this was the last step in the earring just look at it, love it and smile, you have done it optional step is to add this you don't have to make this step, it's up to you, it depends on your taste and so in the same drum ring that holds the charm, we will put the bead inside it. We will open the drum ring of the charm and we will put the bead of our choice inside it. The bead doesn't have to fall down, it's okay, it's okay to stay there, that's fine. Just close it and voila, this is it. I am gonna show it to you again quickly if you want to see it again and enjoy the music. Keep adding the beads and finally it's all done with the twist of the color of the beads of your choice. And voila, I hope you like it. And this is the final look. I hope you found this video useful for you. Thanks so much for watching everybody. Have a nice day and bye bye.